Hempfield School District strives to keep students safe while also providing a fun learning environment. But how does this goal translate to the playground, where entertainment and safety often collide? Well, Mr. Dan Forey says it's all about maintenance. Building custodial supervisors have checklists that they do through. They'll look at the equipment throughout the, the time frame it's being used, look for anything, any breaks, uh, any loose materials, uh, any rusting, anything like that, that we can address and keep it in good shape for the students to use. Usually a big piece of play equipment will, will be out there for 15 to 20 years. You know, if you install it properly, if you're maintaining it, that's usually not an issue. The big thing is you want kids to have fun, but you don't want them getting injured. So the equipment is safe to use, but how does it meet student standards? I like climbing on, them, on uh, the things. I like the swings because, like, they're just fun to swing on. I don't like boys on it. They're annoying. They climb up the slides and everything. Some playground pieces cost up to $20,000, but the school is willing to spend lots of money in order to prevent the students from being harmed. For Happening! I'm Ethan Miller.